Genghis Khan's empire spanned 12 million square miles, but his true legacy may lie in his DNA. Recent studies reveal that his military conquests were accompanied by a systematic strategy to spread his genetic lineage. By analyzing historical records and modern genetic data, we uncover how one man's ambition shaped the gene pool of millions across Asia. Historical accounts show Genghis Khan institutionalized a system of strategic marriages with conquered tribes. Noble women were systematically incorporated into his family, creating a network of genetic alliances. This wasn't random. It was a calculated method to cement political power while ensuring the propagation of his lineage across Eurasia's elite families. Modern genetic research confirms the effectiveness of Genghis Khan's strategy. A 2003 study published in the American Journal of Human Genetics found that approximately 8% of men in former Mongol territories share a distinctive Y-chromosome haplotype, tracing back to a single ancestor who lived in Mongolia about 1,000 years ago. The statistical probability points conclusively to Genghis Khan and his male descendants. Three key factors enabled this unprecedented genetic spread. The Pax Mongolica ensured safe travel routes for his descendants. The Khan's lineage received preferential treatment and resources, and the practice of polygamy among Mongol elites amplified the effect. This created a perfect storm for one lineage to dominate numerically across generations. Today, an estimated 16 million men carry Genghis Khan's Y chromosome, a biological empire that outlasted his political one. This case study demonstrates how historical power structures can leave measurable genetic signatures. It challenges us to reconsider how we measure a ruler's true impact, not just in conquered lands, but in the very fabric of human populations centuries later.